Yeah, I didn't upload for two weeks. 1v1 me in Fortnite, little kids. So, apparently 100% of my audience is female. So, uh, what up, thoughts? Guess I'm, uh, guess I'm the new Justin Bieber now. Okay, so I, uh, I take a two-week break, and I come back, and, uh, yeah, Machinima's dead. Yeah, you remember Machinima? You know that channel from, uh, from 2012? Yeah, they're dead. Oh, boy. <sighs> strap in. Strap in, little kids. Let's go. Let's go for a ride in the van. Now, basically, yesterday, all of a sudden, all of Machinima's videos uh, privated. But everything else is just private. It's, it's all gone. It is all gone. Now, obviously, that's not just Machinima original content. That's content created by other people who uploaded it to the site, to their channel. And they had no idea this was going to happen. No chance to back up their videos, to re-upload later on their channel. Nothing. Just all of it gone. No notice. All of their years of hard work gone. Now, I'm reading this off the Kotaku article. Link will be in the description. Back in December 2018, AT&T moved Machinima under their Otter Media brand in a restructuring that also saw layoffs across Otter Media. Otter Media is made up of other companies including streaming services like VRV and Crunchyroll. In early January, shortly after the restructuring, longtime Machinima creators like Maximilian Dude were let go. Other creators were let go or sent letters informing that they were being moved to full screen. another media company founded in 2011 which is also owned and operated by Otter Media. So right now it's currently unknown if this is all a part of them joining with full screen or if Machinima is just dead. We don't know if the videos will be re-uploaded or what, it's, it's all just gone. As of 3.41pm today, Otter Media has sent Kotaku a statement about the future of Machinima. We are focused on creating new content with the Machinima team, which will be distributed on new channels to be announced in the coming months. In the meantime, the Machinima network of creator channels continues to showcase the talents of the network. Don't know how it's showcasing it if it's all private, but part of this focus on new content, we have pivoted from distributing content on a handful of legacy-operated channels. So basically what they're saying is, uh, yeah, Machinima's dead. We are basically going to turn into a whole new thing, and all your years of hard work creators is now privated, and there's no hope of you getting it back. Sorry. Now, as of right now, we don't know if they're going to delete the Machinima channel or, or what. It has 12.3 million subscribers. Now, uh, if, if you're willing to sell a Machinima, I, uh, I, have, I have an offer to give you. This, uh, I, I want to keep Machinima going. I want to, uh, I want to keep it going. I will sell you this. It is a very exotic animal from South Uganda. You don't know the way. Yeah, January memes from a year ago. Uh, it's a very good, good, good for cult sacrifices. You know, you just throw it in the woods, bunch of candles around it, light it all on fire, start the Californian forest fires. Boom, perfect cult meeting. Now, this could easily sell for at least a couple dollars on eBay. I, I know it sounds like I'm getting ripped off selling this to, to Otter Media, but I really... I, I know this is worth so much, but I I really want to keep Machinima going. I really want to take those 12 million subscribers and, you know, maybe, maybe just change the name a little bit. Just rearrange a couple letters, make it uh, Nathan Cudgel. And maybe in, instead of, uh, like, 50 creators, just have it only be me. Uh, I think that'll be a good restructuring of, uh, of the company. <laughs> That's comedy right there. But overall, uh, it's sad to see Machinima go. Uh, I feel like everyone has seen at least the logo for Machinima before. Uh, you, if you've been around on YouTube since, I want to say at least 2014. I feel like 2014 was the last time Machinima was really going pretty strong. But if you've been around for at least a couple years on YouTube, you know who Machinima is. Or, well, I guess was. But you know all about Machinima. And, uh, yeah, it's just, it's sad to see Machinima go. Yeah, we recently saw Defy Media close, closing down all of Smosh, and it just kind of feels like all the network channels are just closing down right now. I mean, Machinima was by far the largest network channel, and, uh, I mean, they say they're gonna split off into other channels, but Machinima is dead. But anyways, thanks for watching, and, uh, bye! <laughs>
Let's go.